Hello everyone and welcome to this week's Triton Talk. I'm Caroline Lane on the softball team and today I'm with Rhea Jagger from the women's tennis team. So let's get started. You're from Oxford, United Kingdom, transferred from Holy Names University in San Francisco and now in St. Peter Eckerd. Can you talk about your journey here? Um, yeah, so obviously I went to like just a normal school until I was 16 years old and then I went to boarding school for two years and kind of from there it kind of set me up for you know being away from home and all that kind of stuff um, and then I ended up going to San Francisco because it just you know it felt right obviously as it, as it does mm -hmm. and then COVID just ruined everything for me and I guess I kind of just found Eckerd in the process which you know thank god I did. It worked out. Man. Yeah it worked yeah. out definitely worked out. <laughs> yeah that's awesome. Mm -hmm. Um, um, coming from the UK, were there any big culture shocks or things that took like getting used to? I think just the general size of America, like obviously coming from England, or being in Oxford is like a really, like a small city in comparison to anywhere here. Um, and just the size of, you know, everything and everyone was like, really chatty and like full of life I guess which is not really what England's like at all so it kind of took a bit of getting used to for sure but you know I, I like everyone here it was just overwhelming at the beginning. <laughs> <laughs> we know you're a communications major and we heard you're interested in an internship that has to do with public speaking could you tell us about that? Yeah so obviously I graduate next year um, and I want to definitely do an internship that can help people and the fact that I'm also minoring in sociology kind of ties in really well with communication so ideally I would want to go into like mental health or like mental health awareness awesome. because I feel like there's a lot of stigma around that and people do need to be you know ed educated on that because I feel like it's really important um, so I don't know entirely what that would involve but I'd like to be you know in and around big cities and giving it to whatever crowd would take me really and just yeah, you know talking awesome. about that so yeah how have you dealt with being so far away from home what adjustments have you had to make so I mean luckily I am kind of like an independent person as it is um, and going away to boarding school when I was 17 really did set me up for this um, so I guess I mean it's little things like like doing my own laundry, you know, like I have a hard time with that. yeah, yeah, me too, um, and just generally just like looking after myself, I guess, mm -hmm. is a lot harder than people think it is. Um, but you know, I have a great support system here with friends and yeah. stuff that always help you out, so it's not been too bad. Yeah, yeah. Um, your team went to the Miami Open this year. What was your favorite part about that experience? Yeah, that was really cool, actually. That was a really good time. Um, so at the Miami Open, there was actually one of the players there was from England and I actually grew up playing with him. Um, he's called Jack Draper. And so it was kind of weird to see him, you know, compete in this amazing tournament and have hundreds of people watch him. But it was also so cool. Like the fact that he's a Brit is obviously really cool, but you know, growing up with him since I was like eight years old and seeing him now was, was pretty special. Awesome, yeah. yeah, for sure. So what is your favorite thing about Eckerd? I think just like the community that people bring here and like how flexible like professors are, like being a student athlete, I mean, you would know is, can be difficult at times and like missing school is tough. Sure. Yeah, but um, I feel like professors are super flexible with schedule and timings and everything um, and everyone's been really helpful. So I would say that. Yeah. That's awesome. Well, thanks for talking with me today. Um, we'll see you next time and go Tritons. Go Tritons.